Well, if it's not the heat, it's the tropics that has many residents on edge this time of year. Yeah, the same edge that plays a factor in increasing anxiety and depression rates of all ages. Our Faith Colbert spoke with an expert and longtime Coastal Bend resident about ways to help ease those weather nerves. Faith? Good evening, Leslie and Rudy. Although summer has officially just begun last week, we have already seen record-breaking heat and our first tropical storm of the season, Alberto. With more forecasted active weather ahead this summer, don't let your mental health take the back seat. A bit uh, scary. Is the feeling that some Coastal Bend residents have about the future. Many homeowners have already experienced forced isolation due to flooding and hurricane season has just begun. I was literally flooded in for, for three days and uh, even on the fourth day it was still wet out here and, and under a little bit of water. Now even if someone decides to leave and come back after a storm, there's still a looming fear of not knowing what damages may be awaiting once you return. That's why preparing ahead is always the best way to give yourself some peace of mind. We raised the um, bulkhead here uh, out in, on the, the front the canal uh, plus the uh, boat slip uh, 18 inches. And in the meantime, when the tropics quiet down for just a brief moment, dangerous temperatures can also crank up cortisol levels in many individuals. Heat in itself, you know, brings up anxiety levels. Uh, it makes people irritable at times. So the best thing we can do is try and find ways to help somebody get some relief. According to the CDC, 22% of the Texas population reported symptoms of anxiety in April alone. Whether anxiety medication is needed for more serious cases that spike in the summer, or even just putting yourself on a cooling schedule, can make all the difference when it comes to mental stability during this time of year. Always have at least two weeks maybe of medication on hand, um, so that way um, if, you, if you do have to evacuate, you have, you have all that you would need to hold off um, for a few days. And as temperatures continue to reflect summer and as hurricane season runs its timeline, it's likely we'll see anxiety numbers increase as time goes on. This is why if you are dealing with depression or anxiety, help is just a call away. We will have resources linked to this story on our website at KIIITV.com.